Where did you put my hammer? Is that all you care about? Look, my grandfather gave me that damn hammer. I don't care. I've never cared about any of it. Your ass is as big as a mastodon and your teeth smell like Pete Boggs. Who is Pete Boggs? Pete. Boggs with Pete in them. You're about as smart as a retarded third grader. Don't take your shriveled dick anger out on me, Nancy boy. It's not my fault you keep your house at 40 degrees. If you were a real woman, you could have got it up. I'm going to cut your damn arms off with a machete and sell them to child pornographers. You would, you heartless bitch. I might be nicer if someone could satisfy me without being bound and gagged. It's called role playing. It's sick is what it is. Have you ever heard of the missionary position? I swear you are the sickest man I know. You're a clown, woman. Go put on your big red nose and your floppy shoes. Hurt my heart no more. I hope you find your grandfather's hammer lodged up your own rectum, and you have to go to a hospital to get it taken out and the nurse is a hottie and she laughs at you for having a hundred year old hammer up your bum. Then you can't sit down for a week and you have to explain to your boss and friends why that is so. I think I would notice a hammer in my ass. You probably wouldn't, you sick monkey. There's probably several hammers up there right now. I bet there's also a midget and 68 cents in pennies and nickels. I hope there is. I need change for parking. I never loved you. I never wanted you to. I wanted to date your sister, but she moved away. So I shut my eyes and let you have your way with me. Loser. Pig woman. You have the head of a pig and the body of a 50 year old Dungeons and Dragons player whose mother forces him to go outside once a week so that he doesn't forget what it's like. You're a turd burglar. I have to keep my toilets flushed and shut and my litter box clean whenever you come over to keep you from burgling turds out of my house. Slut. Go watch Smokey and the Bandit. That is an excellent movie and I will not apologize for loving it, or the sequel, which is just as fine. Whom? Yes. Well, should we get this job interview underway? Of course. How do you feel you would be an asset to this company?